I had a busy weekend. I didn't have enough for a full project, but I did have enough for this. What is this, you might ask? This is an adjustable height workbench. So right now I just have it powered by a drill, and up she goes. So what's going on inside? Actually inside of here are two trailer jacks. So the jacks are actually upside down and this is how the handle would normally be. So what I did was got half inch rod, which is the same width as the handle was, and then ran it from this side all the way over here. You can see coming over here, coming over here, coming over here, coming over here, coming over here. So that as you turned one jack, both were going up at the same time. Modifying the jacks from the handle to the steel rod was actually pretty easy. All I had to do was drill some holes to hold the pin and then take apart all of the gears and slide my rod through in place of the handle, if that makes any sense. Now I had to take these apart and put them back together three or four times to get the gears and the jacks going in the right direction so that when one was going up, one wasn't going down. I needed them both to go up at the same time. So I made two plywood boxes, one that fit directly around the trailer jack itself, and then one that fit around that box. I couldn't use the trailer jack normally where the insert comes out because then the whole top would move up and down. So I needed to flip it over upside down and have the trailer jack push up. So that would mean that my crank or my drill would be all the way down on here on the floor. So what I did was just got some cheap uh, half inch rod spur gears, some roller chain, and then a bearing uh, holder. I forget what kind of bearing holder this is, but basically the rods in here, you can see. Now it's not any secret that this is some sort of adjustable height workbench, but I'm not gonna tell you quite yet what I'm building it for. But I will tell you this, that I wanted a way to have an outfeed table coming out of the table saw most of the time. And then when I want something on this middle shelf, I can pull the top off, raise it up, and then the middle shelf becomes the top shelf. See if you can guess why I might want that. Since it's made with 2,000 pound trailer jacks, there is no question about its strength. <laughs> so next week I'll finish up the outfeed table and the middle shelf and actually get this thing working. But if you're interested in making your own adjustable height desk, this mechanism right here is all you need. So I thought it was worth sharing separately. Bye guys. Bye.